Hello, thank you so much for tuning in. You guys, this video is for Taurus. Okay, if you're a Taurus, thank you so much for tuning in. You guys, subscribe, hit the notification bell, like, share, comment. Check out my Facebook, my Instagram, my other videos on YouTube. You can book a full reading with me right now for $25 or a mini reading for $15. I also have a package available. You can buy these boxes. They're beautiful. They come with everything you need to save your home, your energy, and to protect it. So if you're interested, let me know. That is down below. <sighs> Let's go ahead and get started. This is a general read, okay? Even though it's for Taurus, it's still a general, so it may or may not resonate with you, okay? But let's go ahead and see what we get. Let's see what we get for Taurus. All right. What do we have for Taurus today? What are the messages that we have for Taurus? Our uh, earth signs. <laughs> what do we have for Taurus? Oh, sorry, you guys. <laughs> what do we got for Taurus? Let's get one card. Wow, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. <laughs> Somebody's praying, healing, meditating, going within, resting, sleeping, probably <laughs> regarding a karmic situation, healing yourself, praying. Eight of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, some good news coming in your way. Somebody stood their grounds. Could be uh, Page of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, here you are. All right, Taurus right here as well. The Hierophant. Working on your money, your pinnacles. Um, again, towards Virgo Capricorn, your outcome. Um, holding on to something. Choosing to hold on. All right. Having a grip on something. This could be seen as choosing to hold on and let go. At the sun at the sun card. At the bottom, we got the sun card, the yes card. That could be seen as Leo energy. I'm going to go ahead and clarify you guys. Let's see what you guys have. All right. So, um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Aries, Leo, Sag, and then your own energy, Taurus. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, you may be young um, or starting in something new, a new opportunity regarding finances, career. I feel like some of you guys, you work out or you take care of yourself physically. I feel like you've grown. Clarify the four swords. Too many. Some of you guys are praying, again, justice and seven of swords. Some of you guys are praying, growing within because somebody has you feeling stuck. Or bound, somebody was probably deceitful, lying, all right, cheating you out of your time or energy, or cheating with somebody. But justice is served, you guys. This could have been a karmic situation, a person, and you have to go within. Let's get one. <laughs> Let's get one. One card for our lovely Taurus. Knight of Pentacles. Again, you're showing up here. You could have been dealing with the air sign or a fellow. Um, Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn at the bottom, the chariot moving forward, Cancer energy. So we're taking steps, we're leveling up. Page, night, starting new. Somebody's um, probably thinking about or praying about some type of opportunity, stability. All right, could be dealing with your finances. You know, how can I get this long term opportunity? Something that can take care of me, something that, you know, I can grow. It might come in slow, move like molasses, but it'll be something that will last you for a long time for a while some of you guys a lifetime you probably work seeing how can you build your money <laughs> the empress at the bottom the high priestess could be talking to my divine feminine somebody trusted their intuition or listened to their intuition or your intuition is telling you the things that you need to hear <laughs> Woo! sorry my hair almost felt like a bug, y'all. Y'all don't even know I'm afraid of bugs. <laughs> like, sorry. Like, there's some good news coming into you. All right. Listen to your intuition. Moving forward, probably there's a business idea or a career opportunity. And you got to listen to yourself. Follow yourself. Clarify the page of pinnacles. The magician. Somebody's manifesting. Wow, the eight of swords at the bottom. Again, the eight of wands. This is really good news, you guys. Good communication. Somebody might be communicating back and forth about a job opportunity or your career or business. Ace of swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Again, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Having the clarity that you need. Some good news coming in quickly for you guys. So clarify the four of pinnacles. Thank you. Beautiful. What again? Ah, the hard fun. There you go. And the empress finally came out. Some of you guys, too, you can probably be choosing to hold on to somebody, like somebody you love. That can be, oh, do I hold on to this empress? Some of you guys, you may have somebody, um, probably like, like you see 
somebody who gives unconditional love to you or really loves you maybe you may have to decide if you want to hold on to them or not for others of you guys this could be you the empress and your power listen to your intuition knowing what you need to hold on to and what you need to let go of some of you guys are holding on to a business idea or some type of situation or something that can bring you in money maybe talk to somebody who can bring you in this this opportunity but somebody's trying to hold on to something all right and let me just clarify it one more time okay yeah <laughs> so oh they either want somebody's waiting for their ships to come in like yeah some type of opportunity you some of you guys already decided now you're just waiting for it to come in okay it's not really telling me but it could just be money we saw pinnacles and you are earth so you are getting grounded okay we will pull one from my love and then we'll pull a time frame but yeah i feel like somebody went within regarding the opportunity all right you know really resting and recharging yourself so you can move forward towards this all right getting some good news and also if this is a lover you guys somebody probably was trying to give you a love offer you know something long term and stable commitment maybe they're coming in with this good news they're wanting to start off with you and grow and build and they're wanting to hold on to you and love you okay take the how that resonates okay Taurus <laughs> and throughout your whole reading you got Aries Leo Sagittarius Gemini Libra Aquarius and Taurus Virgo Capricorn you got all your own energy no no water <laughs> no Pisces Cancer Scorpio somebody's probably just about their money all right and we got wedding bells all right union wedding married soul connection eternal love everlasting promise again somebody could be bringing that in so you wanted to choosing you all right waiting for you to be ready and at the bottom healthy choices making healthy choices in love and in life self-love self-care being happier when you love yourself you can definitely love somebody else all right <laughs> let's get a time frame for Taurus. what is our time frame for this situation some of you guys are coming to opportunity with your pinnacles <laughs> some of you are coming to opportunity with your finances it could be your business it could be your, your job whatever it is listen to your intuition it's guiding you it's giving you the clarity that you need the universe is too Taurus sign, they're giving you the clarity. Listen, okay? And I feel like you are. Let's get one for the time frame, one card for the time frame. Wow. I was about to be happy, but you know. <laughs> we got, wow, foundation and achievements and material harvest. Number four. But let's get one. <laughs> let's get one card. Oh. 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 I'm being so lazy. <laughs> Fertility, number three. <laughs> Some of you guys could be pregnant. Starting a new idea at the bottom. Four foundations and achievements. All right, three days, three weeks, three months. This is pretty quick, you guys. Ooh, I just noticed this. Four of swords, four of pentacles, four for, your t for a time frame. If it would have came out by itself. Angel number four, four, four for some of you guys. Angel number 88. All right. Sorry, guys, my piercing. <laughs> All right. And so three days, three weeks, three months. Some of you guys could be, again, pregnant or birthing new ideas of creation. <sighs> it's beautiful. Some of you guys may have gotten somebody pregnant, your empress pregnant. Number three, look, 33, angel number 333, three, 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 three of wands. <laughs> somebody see an angel number. Some, some of you guys may have gotten somebody pregnant or you want to marry somebody who you see as a, a wife material, mother material. All right, you let me know how that resonates for you, okay? Let me know, Taurus. Let's move forward. Let's get a message. Let's pull from my moon cards. What message do we have from the moon cards about this situation? What message do we have for Taurus? Thank you. Ooh, divine masculine okay divine masculine divine feminine somebody taking action towards the happiness okay number number 11 fear we're letting go of fears and illusions all right i don't feel like you're in fear i don't feel like you you're scared maybe you probably was in the past or once but i don't feel like you are all right any fear is an illusion it's false evidence appearing real it's not true so and i feel like too this could have been yourself too keeping yourself in your own mind and scaring yourself stopping yourself self-sabotaging 
okay, because it's you. But you break free. I feel like you go within, and this is where everything unfolds for you. All right, let's put one for my light cards. You know we got to do the moon and the light. Okay, the sun and the moon. This is exactly how these cards feel. <laughs> okay, let's pull for Taurus. What message do we have? What message do we have? Thank you. Yes! <laughs> Just say yes. <laughs> Whatever that means for you. Dance with life. Do something to change your energy. If you ever get stuck or if you're ever going to fear anything that's negative energy, um, you can go dance, listen to music, watch people dance. <laughs> um, go out, you guys. But yes, just say yes towards whatever that is for you. All right, I feel like you know what that is. Your new beginning. All right, this situation. <laughs> you know, I can't say that for you. Let's get a spirit animal. Wow. Blue Jay. Okay. I love birds. What's, what was I just whistling? I don't know, you guys, but I do whistle. And I do whistle songs. You guys should hear me whistle high notes. <laughs> I should make an OnlyFans doing whistles. That would be so funny. <laughs> Either way, your spirit animal is a blue jay. Sorry, Taurus. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Look, back on track. Your spirit animal is a blue jay. A sort of daring and universal wisdom. You are being guided to be aware of synchronicities in your life. You are entering a time of intellectual and spiritual growth. New truths are forming each day. Be fearless. Trust your gut. Be your authentic self. Take inspired action and your desires will come to fruition. Ah, I love it. Yeah, some of you guys, you're going to be going through a spiritual transformation, okay? Yeah, beautiful. Your true authentic self is showing out. Listen. Your intuition will never guide you wrong. I feel like this is a, I feel like this is a type of situation. <laughs> Thank you. Wow. Synchronicity again. Remember when I said 333444? <laughs> hope. Okay, having hope is your positive affirmation. I am filled each day with hope, knowing that tomorrow is a new day and anything is excuse me, anything is possible. It is. And I'm, I think because you feel that way too, you're gonna actually be able to experience that. Wow. Let's get a message from the angels. Angels, what do we have for Taurus? What message do we have for our Taurus? Wow. Intuition, y'all. Your angels speak to you through intuition. Angels, what do we have for Taurus? Y'all wanted to say something, but it didn't come all the way out, huh? <laughs> wow. Savings at the bottom, employment change. What? You're, what, Taurus? Are you not grounded? Are you not about your pentacles? Employment change. You're, this is what the angels are telling you, okay? Your career path is leading you in a higher direction with positive changes to support your dreams, priorities, passion, and life purpose. Trust that these changes will help you release the old and welcome the new. You are being supported each step of the way. And release jealousy. Jealousy is an affirmation that you don't have something, and the universe manifests exactly as you affirm. Let other people's success inspire rather than frustrate you. If they can have it, so can you. Some of you guys, you may see somebody else with their money on point or their life looking like they got it all together, and you may be feeling like, huh? Why is that? Why am I not getting it? And they're telling you, don't think like that. All right? You already, what's yours is you're focused on yourself. Whatever you want, it's going to come to you, because if you think... Like you don't have it, that's exactly what you're going to manifest. You're not going to have it. So they're telling you, when you see other people who are doing good or where you want to be for some of you guys, let that inspire you and say, hey, you know what? I can get there and I can actually pass that. Okay? And you can. So don't allow it to get you down. Because whatever somebody else can have, somebody else can have. Like literally. So don't worry. Just follow yourself. All right, and let's get some advice to help our lovely Taurus sleep. If they have, if you have trouble sleeping, this can help you. Okay, it's a practice or exercise you can do. Those are pretty much shuffled up. So, 
they don't really need to be <laughs> that. Centered breathing. Finally, one I haven't seen. Centered breathing. Let's see what it says. It says, lie down, place your hands on your diaphragm, and close your eyes. Breathe in and out gently. Feel your hands going up and down in your body. Diaphragm is the muscle that tenses when you are stressed or afraid. Fear. If your diaphragm feels tight or tense, it's difficult to breathe gently. Try to expand your breath and do just... Okay, try to expand your breath and do just a few of these breaths at a time. <laughs> okay, yeah, do a few breaths at a time. <laughs> I am gentle towards myself, okay, Taurus, and that will help you sleep. And I pray that resonated, but of course we're going to do a recap, okay? Let's do a recap for you guys. You're healing yourself. You're going within, you're resting, all right? You got a new change, a new beginning, something's happening. But you're going within, you're praying, meditating, could be about an offer about some stability something long term probably a little bit slow but it'll come in stable some good news is coming to you good some good news all right your intuition is speaking to you it's guiding you it's letting you know what's for you and what's not you're getting the clarity that you need from the universe from the divine from god they're giving you the knowledge the mental peace that you need whatever you've been praying for it's been heard it's been answered and it could have been regarding finances okay you're in your own energy, all up in this energy. It's about you, okay? <laughs> you're growing spiritually, physically, mentally, emotionally, on every level. You're holding on to something good. I feel like something good for you. You're going to choose to hold on. Whatever you're praying or meditating about, you may choose to hold on to whatever it is that you were thinking about, okay? Holding on to it and waiting for it to come into you like a reality, all right? beautiful energy somebody could be pregnant you can have somebody pregnant I want to start a family as well somebody probably wants to bring a stability to, to your life an offer however this is re resonating for you okay for a love card it said wedding rings union wedding marriage soul connection eternal love everlasting promise your time frame is three three days three weeks three months you guys are seeing angel numbers three 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 four 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 all right um, fear, letting go of fears and illusions, false evidence appearing real, things that keep us stuck. Um, we're, we're, we're thinking that through, we're pushing through it, and we're letting ourselves free. We're not self-sabotaging ourselves this time. Every We're letting go of fears, all right? And yes, just say yes, whatever that means to you. Blue Jay for your spirit animal, assertive daring, universal wisdom, having hope, my Taurus. Okay, your positive affirmation. The angels want you to know that you have an appointment change coming to you to make you feel better and to help you and to release jealousy because what's yours is yours. And if somebody can have it, you can too, okay? To help you sleep, centered breathing, focus on your breathing. You know, really like, you know, really just allowing stuff to breathe, okay? I am gentle towards myself, all right? That will help you sleep. If this resonated for you, Taurus, subscribe, hit the notification bell, comment, like, share, check out Facebook, Instagram, my other videos on YouTube. Book a full reading for $25 or $15. Buy a package, you guys, for your for yourself, okay? Give it as a gift. <laughs> it's beautiful. I love you guys. Stay strong. Continue to be grounded. And whatever you're holding on to, I feel like it's good for you. So, good job, and I'll see you guys later.